children now previously s3 we have learnt about women and the games how they are uh, in every field how women has taken participation in all types of games right like weight lifting uh, weight lifting uh, boxing karate whatever it is in every uh, game they have participated and uh, they have uh, named and uh, we are proud uh, for them okay right now today we will learn block 4 fun and games s4 fair and circus now what is fair fair is nothing like mela it's nothing but it is known as mela that uh, in your in our school of so many times we had a fair right in that uh, we need a, a open space open ground so that we can keep some stalls games eatery things all these things and you will go with your friends and family and you will enjoy right so that is a mela that is a fair now that also no not in one place they can go in any other place and they can have fair right like kum mela sam mela even you will also go from uh, to other places also that is known as fair now in this fair number one sell sells food clothes and craft you will buy also number 2 has giant wheel merry go round that is giant wheel then three temporary stall they are temporary stalls they are not permanent stalls okay now this is all fair what is fair you understood now about circus in circus uh, in circus has clowns acrobats trapeze artists now uh, in circus actually in circus they will have and they will train animals and they will show tricks and that will be they in that also they need big ground they need tent in the tent only they can show their tricks okay and in that clowns you will see the clown they will do some tricks and they will have fun we will have fun and we'll laugh with them acrobats which they show the tricks like aerobics right like gymnasts they'll go from one uh, one they will swing from one uh, one corner to the other corner or they will show the tricks trapeze is nothing but on the rod they will swing okay they will swing and they show their Uh, acrobats or uh, yes that one that they are the artist you and i can't do this they will have lots of practice okay they have to take training also they will learn from uh, from one another then second one and in a round tent that will be a round tent and has animals with the animals they will show all types of wild animals we can see also children okay but not <laughs> in open they will cover it up and with the help of uh, some protection we can see right but nowadays we could not able to see we can see in our television also right okay children now you can see in your reader take out page number 30 in this reader you can see this merry go round a fair moves from place to place you can see the stall and everything and now your acrobat acrobats and trapeze artists in a 
circus you can see this how see this picture two pictures now i'll say children i'll say few points please listen very carefully now here fair are fun place places where people set up shops to sell different things and food fairs or melas are held for a short time in different they are short time they means only one day or two day like that now circuses are also fun place which moves from place to place both this fair and circus they need open ground and they are temporary a circus has clowns acrobats who can move their bodies as they wish and trapeze artists who swings in the air holding rods from the ceiling at times a circus also has animals like elephants tigers or monkeys to show tricks these animals are caught and trained by people now now fairs are usually held in open ground and circuses in huge tent they need tent fairs sell handmade things like toys decoration items and other interesting things they have a giant field and merry go round which we may not find in regular market or shopping malls you you will not see all these things a circus has clowns acrobats and other fun things which are all real unlike movies they are all real we will see live we can go to circus or a fair with family and friends and have a fun time right children i'll uh, tell you that even in our hyderabad you can see that exhibitions right that also you will go every year in january month with our family we will go to hyderabad exhibition also right and you will enjoy you will buy the things okay children now i will read from reader take out your reader children page number 30 apart from games there are after ways to have fun with our families and friends we we can we can go for picnics visit a zoo go shopping watch a movie listen to music or re- read a book we can also go to a fair or a circus to have fun fairs a fair is a place where people sell things like toys crafts and clothes fairs can have a giant wheel merry go round and food stalls too they are usually held large grounds where temporary stalls are set up fairs are not fixed to one place they move from place to place and set set up stalls to sell their things circus a circus is a group of people such as acrobats clowns and trapeze artists who travel from one place to another to entertain people and earn money is that is also a livelihood for them children a circus is generally held in a big ground tent after it performs for some time in one place it moves on to another place it goes from to other place those who perform in a circus practice for many years some circuses 
are use animals like lions tigers and elephants to show people tricks now you understood children i have explained also and i have read in your reader also so that it will be easy to understand take out your workbook page number 27 now put a cross mark for those that you may see in a circus and a tick mark for those you may see in a fair or mela children when you will put tick mark please put tick mark how i put don't put so big big tick mark you will don't do that children okay number a a you can see circus for circus you will put tick mark and b what you will see clown cross mark okay that is for circus to identify children to identify which is fair, fair and which is which is circus in your picture c again cross mark d you can see merry go round tick mark e some tricks is doing in circus that is cross mark and f again he, uh, elephant is showing his trick that is in circus cross mark you understood children okay now i'll start question 2 give two reasons why fairs and circus are fun places to visit now slowly you listen nicely okay and you can see this video if you don't understand you can see okay two three times also you can see and read and write okay first point a fair f a i r fair is a place where w h e r where people sell things like toys comma craft c r a f t s crafts and clothes c l o t h e s clothes, clothes full stop next line 2 second point that is a circus in a group g r o u p group of people such as acrobats a c r o b a t s acrobats comma clowns c l o w n s clowns and trapeze t r a p e z e trapeze artists a r t i s t e s artists who travel t r a v e l travel from one place to another a n o t h e r another to entertain e n t e r t a i n entertain people and earn e a r n earn money m o n e y money you can see it from your reader also but here clearly i have told you now this is two points na huh, in this okay now third one third question write one thing each that you do not like in a fair and a circus which you don't like see sometimes we will go out we will go somewhere and sometimes we like the things and sometimes we don't like the thing so like that way i have written here children first one circus in circus what you don't like 
that you have to write i do not like write children i do not like after that you have to continue the sentence that i will not tell you children that is your answer your choice children that is your choice okay so that you have to continue second one fair then you have to write again i means you i do not like what you don't like in the uh, fairs any shops or anything whichever you don't like okay that only one two words and one sentence you have to that's all that is your own choice that is your wish okay okay children complete this everything ha huh, children okay all the rest